Alright, today's Black Arts Tool video is going to be on Wireshark. And Wireshark doesn't have as many capabilities when you're not running it as root. So we'll run it as root just so we get the any interface, the Bluetooth interface, and the wireless uh, interface. Because those aren't on there with the default privileges. So type in my root password now. Great. And... These are the ones I was talking about. They're not available if you're just running it with default privileges. So let's let's capture any packets using the this is Wireshark, the network traffic analyzer, and we'll hit the any interface and press the fin button in the top left to start sniffing or start capturing. And these are <coughs> I don't have many programs running for a reason because if I did, like if I had an update running, it would fill up this whole window with traffic. But as you can see, it has the name of the the IP where the traffic's coming from and the destination IPs. Okay, <clears throat> now <clears throat> say we're looking for malware or we just want to investigate this service because if we click follow TCP. You always want to follow the, the, the packet uh, information, um, and that will explain what the packet is. Now, this is kind of a bad example because it doesn't display what the file is that's running. So this is a good example of, gee, maybe this is malware running on my system. So because Some, sometimes the antiviruses won't pick up malware if it's fully undetectable. So in order to scan this uh, service, or not scan the service, but uh, check up on this service and figure out what is really, what it's really doing is we can run netstat and pipe the output through grep and we'll search because it says it's uh, going to port 56418 so we'll do netstat pipe through grep 56418 and very quickly it tells us that it's actually mega which is a file downloader and it's actually running in the bottom right you can see I have this mega window open so that's good because that means it's just mega and if we go back to the window there aren't any other there aren't any other um, things running um, than mega so um, this looks like it's a different service follow so you always want to follow the TCP when when uh, checking these packets and figuring out what the packets do and this is another mega packet, which is great, meaning my system is clear of any suspicious stuff. Now, suspicious stuff, if it was running, it would pop up here, and it would show you the port, which you could look up, and from there you can find the service and the file. So, that's pretty much all for today. With um, Here you can see it's my router. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all for today for... Today's tool demo, we showed you the basics of Wireshark and how you can figure out what the traffic is and what it does. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all. And um, please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you have a tool request or you'd like me to make a video about a certain thing, please just drop a comment. And you can also check out my website, hackguru.tech, for other cool stuff. So, alright, thank you for watching, guys, and bye-bye.